First of all, I want to apologize for any background noise you may hear. Um, the kids just got home from soccer practice and they're a little bit rambunctious right now. Um, I had Chris send me a file. He said he was having problems with it and every time he tried to export this and then go and run it in the Torchmate software, he was getting multiple paths. So if I were to bring up my Torchmate software, I'm assuming this is what it looks like when he goes to cut it. As you can see, we're not just getting one part, we're getting uh, the one part repeated multiple times with different offsets. Um, so taking a look at this file, you don't see any problem. However, what we want to do is come up here and check this button, Show Tool Paths. And you'll notice that as we do that, it looks exactly like our other file. So I'm going to get rid of that. I'm going to move our regular shape over to the right, deselect it, Show Tool Paths, and I'm going to delete these tool paths. One thing you have to keep in mind, um, if you were to leave this regular path and the tool paths in here, the software is going to try to cut every single one of them, including the regular path. So um, with that in mind, let's delete the tool paths. Let's move our regular piece back over here and, and apply a male tool path to it. I'm going to deselect the show tool paths, delete my regular object, um, which you'll probably want to save off in a file on its own first, and then come and show my tool path again. Now, because I got rid of the regular object, and I just have this tool path, if I were to export this, we'll call it Chris2. And if I were to come and import this, let me select a tool. And if I were to run this, you'll go ahead and you'll see that, first of all, we only have the one path instead of uh, four different paths. And it's going to cut the inside and then the outside. And I'm just going to pause this, tell it to jump, and come up to here. And tell it to start. Basically, it would have wrapped around. But this is done at this point, and the file is complete. So the simple problem that you're having is that you were not showing the tool paths, and you had multiple tool paths in your file. I hope this helps you and anybody else that might be running into this similar issue. Thanks for watching.